It has been 10 years since the septic tank was pumped out. And all the YouTube videos say I need to do it in three to five years. So it was a worry. I dug out the two access covers. They were about two feet under the ground. The first attempt to get the cover off, I knew this cover was going to be bad. It stuck back 10 years ago when we pumped it out. And uh, I knew it was going to be stuck. So this is a fence post, a six inch diameter fence post. And we tried to pull it out with that and the post started to break. So it was tough. So the next try was with a steel pipe. The steel pipe was connected with a chain to the handle on the cover. And there's a farm jack on one end and here I go. This jack combined with the pipe gives a leverage of about 60 to 1. So I figure we're putting 25 or 30 pounds on the handle here. I'm getting up to around 1,500 pounds. So this is very difficult to get out. And there, it's loose. And the man who was going to do the pumping told me don't to worry. He was just going to pull it out with a hook. Like crazy he was. <laughs> now here's the second cover off of the, the, the input side of the tank. I knew this was going to be a lot easier, and it sure was, uh, especially after you've done one, you know how to do the second one. So there we go. That one's loose, too. I wrapped the chain around the handle quite a few times to spread out the force because I was afraid the handles might break. So a few days later, the truck shows up. The truck showed right up on time. They brought out the hose. Pulled out the covers with no problem at all since I had them loose. I looked in the tank. It looked uh, pretty darn good actually for being 10 or 12 years uh, without being pumped out. There, uh, the, it, the scum on the top was not bad and uh, there didn't look like to be too much deterioration of the tank. There was some deterioration of the t cover on the output side of the tank which uh, he said is pretty normal. Uh, the gases eat up the concrete, so there is a limited life on these cement tanks. And when it was all finished, it's all covered up again. You can see the leech line goes off to the distance there towards the trees, so I don't think there's a problem there. I put two stakes in the ground so I could find the covers again. There are fence posts po at the edges. The reason being I don't want a tractor or anything to drive over it. So in 10 years, I'll get to do it again.